Samsung's Galaxy Z foldables may not be the most cutting-edge foldables you can buy these days, but they are certainly the most popular ones around. Other Android OEMs have competed well against Samsung, packing in better specifications on their flip and fold foldables. If you were hoping for Samsung to turn the tables this year, your wait might be over this time. According to a claim from Tipster Crow Row, the Galaxy Z Fold 6 is rumored to come with an anti-reflective screen. If this turns out to be true, the Z Fold 6 could potentially feature the same Gorilla Glass armor protection that debuted with the Galaxy S24 Ultra. This new feature would likely enhance the phone's cover screen, making it more resistant to reflections from sunlight and other light sources. As a result, the Galaxy Z Fold 6 could offer improved screen visibility in outdoor conditions. As we already know, titanium has quickly gained popularity as a material for flagship smartphone shells due to its lightweight and durable qualities. Both the iPhone 15 Pro and Galaxy S24 Ultra have recently incorporated titanium into their frames, and now it seems that Samsung's upcoming foldable, the Z Fold 6, will also feature this metal. According to the reliable leaker Tech Rev, who shared the news on X, the Z Fold 6 will be equipped with titanium. While this doesn't necessarily mean a full titanium frame, it suggests that the foldable will have a titanium shell, providing enhanced durability and potentially reducing its weight. However, it's worth noting that the Galaxy Z Fold 5 already uses an aluminum shell, so the weight reduction may not be significant. The iPhone 15 Pro managed to shed 19 gram by switching from stainless steel to titanium, but the S23 Ultra to S24 Ultra only achieved a modest 2 gram reduction by switching from aluminum. Nevertheless, the toughness of titanium is a welcome addition, even if it comes at a higher cost. Initially, there were rumors of a possible Galaxy Z Fold Ultra with a titanium upgrade, but it seems that idea may no longer be in the works. Apart from this, Samsung's upcoming flagship foldables are rumored to feature larger batteries compared to their predecessors. However, it seems that there might not be an upgrade in charging speeds. Both the Galaxy Z Fold 6 and Z Flip 6 have recently obtained certification in China, which includes Samsung's standard 25 watts charger. This charger is tested and approved for all Galaxy smartphones and tablets that support 25 watts charging. Although the certification mentions the 25 watts charger, it doesn't necessarily mean that it will be the maximum charging speed for the new phones. In the past, flagship Galaxy phones that support 45 watts charging have also been tested with the 25 watts charger. Therefore, these certifications may not provide the final confirmation of the device's maximum charging speed. There is a possibility that only the Z Fold 6 will support 45 watts charging, while the Z Flip 6 is expected to have the same battery capacity as the base Galaxy S24, which only supports 25 watts charging. It's important to note that there is no concrete evidence suggesting that the Z Fold 6 will come with a larger battery. If it doesn't, Samsung may not equip either model with 45 watt support. However, Samsung always has the potential to surprise us, especially considering that their foldable devices have been limited to 25 watts charging since their inception. We'll have to wait and see what Samsung has in store for us with their next flagship foldables. Meanwhile, Samsung's latest patent application hints at an exciting new Galaxy Eye feature that could be on the horizon, possibly coinciding with the launch of the Galaxy Z Flip 6 and Z Fold 6 later this year. This innovative AI feature, outlined in a Kipra's application, aims to utilize artificial intelligence to analyze user search queries and provide personalized document and article summaries tailored to the user's political views, interests, and more. By leveraging user data collected from Galaxy devices, including preferences, knowledge levels, and political leanings, this patented system promises to deliver customized summaries. While Samsung already offers AI-powered summary tools through the Galaxy A suite for One UI 6.1 and select devices like the Galaxy S24 series, this new feature takes personalization to the next level by summarizing content based on individual interests. Users may even have the ability to direct the AI on how they want content summarized, whether it be a brief and neutral summary or a more detailed one with a negative tone. The potential unveiling of this new AI tool at Samsung's upcoming Unpacked event in early July remains uncertain, as patent applications do not always materialize into actual products or services. However, reports from Korean media, citing industry sources, suggest that the new AI feature could make its debut alongside the Galaxy Z Flip 6 and Z Fold 6. 
Samsung's Precious phone currently starts at $1799, so any additional costs should be approached cautiously if foldables are to go mainstream. What can we anticipate from the Z Fold 6? Upgrading to the Qualcomm Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 seems like a logical step, and rumors suggest a wider aspect ratio on the cover screen, similar to the Pixel Fold. With Samsung's previous foldables receiving the S24's A features through a software update, it's likely the Z Fold 6 will follow suit. However, don't hold your breath for a built-in S Pen or any hardware camera improvements. Reports have indicated that Samsung is gearing up to release two Galaxy Z Fold 6 models this year. While some speculations point towards the second book-style foldable being a budget-friendly option, others suggest the contrary. However, a recent report suggests that a more affordable Samsung foldable might be on the horizon. Initially, the cheaper variant was anticipated to be priced at around $1,000 or $1,200. But now, it is rumored that the South Korean company will introduce a cheaper version of the Galaxy Z Fold 6 this year with an even more attractive price tag to boost sales. According to the latest report from TechRev, Samsung is looking to launch a budget-friendly iteration of its Galaxy Z Fold series phone this year, priced at just $800. If this turns out to be true, it would certainly pique the interest of many. While the specific name of the device remains unknown, it's not far-fetched to speculate that Samsung might dub it the Galaxy Z Fold 6 FE. To achieve this lower price point, Samsung is expected to make some compromises. The processor, display, and battery specifications are likely to be downgraded, while the cameras are rumored to be similar to the current model, with a dual camera setup. Last month, we broke the news that Samsung is gearing up for its next Galaxy Unpacked event in July 2024. The star of the show will be the launch of the highly anticipated Galaxy Z Flip 6 and Z Fold 6. Rumors are swirling that a more affordable version of the Galaxy Z Fold 6 might also be in the works, but its release could face a slight delay. According to a fresh report from the ELEC, Samsung is planning to kickstart production of the Galaxy Foldables a couple of weeks earlier than usual. This means that the launch of these cutting-edge foldable phones could be pushed up by a few weeks as well. This latest report corroborates our earlier scoop about an expedited launch timeline. As for the budget-friendly Galaxy Z Fold 6, it is expected to hit the market around the same time as the iPhone 16 series. The production of components for the Galaxy Z Flip and Fold 6 is slated to commence in early May 2024. So the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6 is looking like an incredible new folding phone from Samsung and for a device that's kept the same design for some time. Now it's great that we're finally getting some changes in all areas. Now a bigger cover display with a wider aspect ratio is going to make the phone a lot more more usable for those times that where you want to do something quickly and you don't want to unfold into the larger display and the brighter display along with the new A features powered by the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3, means general usability is going to be greatly improved. The fact that they're also thinning down the phone. On top of all this is just a bonus, and to be honest, the Z Fold 5 already looked like a very premium device, so I'm very excited for the Z Fold 6. Now, because of the similarities to its predecessor, I can't see anyone with a Fold 5 rushing for an upgrade, but for those in an older Fold or looking to try out their first Fold, then the Galaxy Z Fold 6 is going to be a great place to start. Now we've still got some time until the official launch, so it's likely we're going to get more and more leaks coming in, and of course I'll be sharing them as soon as they do. So make sure you subscribe, so you don't miss a thing in the future.